Welcome back to the channel. I got to do this real quick, real quick. You 2011 Chrysler Town & Country or Dodge Caravan owners, you experiencing P0344 or P0369 or any of the cam sensor codes. I can't remember them by heart off the top of my head, but any of the cam sensor fault codes, 2011 year model I'm talking about. Uh, the problem you having is uh, some of the symptoms may include a long crank time uh, and you keep getting to check in the light with these fault codes. Keep in mind, uh, any of the cam sensor fault codes and you've essentially replaced your cam sensor and you're still having this problem, chances are uh, there's a glitch in your PCM. Uh, the Chrysler engineers informed us a while back, actually, I'm just seeing it myself, but uh, there's a glitch in your PCM software. What they need you to do is hightail it on down to a Chrysler dealership and get your PCM, what we call flash update, reprogramming. What that, what that do is uh, they simply wipe out the old calibrations out of your computer and put in new calibration. That will repair that glitch, okay? Any cam sensor problem you have, and it's on the 2011 model. They got a hold of it in 2012 and 2013 and you know so forth and so on, but for the most part, keep in mind that 2011 was the first year Chrysler put the 3.6 engine in the minivan. So there was some bugs. There's still some bugs they're working out, but I need to let y'all know, uh, you know, there's a glitch in your PCM. Now you gotta also keep in mind this uh, minivan or this engine came with a, a phaser. You got intake phaser and a cam phaser on each head. So if you experiencing these colds and you hear noises, chances are your phasers are worn out. They're gone, they're spring loaded and they, you know, from time to time they'll make a lot of noise. So if you're hearing the noise, you're gonna need phasers at this point. But um, if you're not hearing the noise and you're getting these fault codes, go down to your local Chrysler dealer. And the only reason I'm saying go to your local Chrysler dealer is because they're the only one that have the uh, uh, scan tool and the software that can perform the job. Now, unless the shop you go to have a subscription with Chrysler, that is the only way they have the proper scan tool and the proper software to get the job done. So it's not that I'm promoting the dealership, but if you go to a shop that don't have either of those, uh, you just be wasting your money. There's nothing they can do for you because you need your computer flash update. All right. Now, if you're in the Atlanta area, you can simply come on Highway 78 in uh, Gwinnett and uh, we can do it. Uh, Gwinnett Chrysler Plymouth Jeep Dodge. But how tell it to any Chrysler dealership. Now, is this free? Is this a recall? No, it's not a recall. This was a TSB uh, that was sent out to uh, the Chrysler technicians. They have access to this type of information. And uh, I don't know. It could be on the Internet. I'm not sure. But I'm here to let you know. That is your problem. Now, some of you may have already replaced your cam sensors, and that's cool. That's okay. You probably was going to need them in the future anyway, but if you have and you're still having this problem, I suggest you go down to your Chrysler dealership and get your computer updated. All right? I want to keep this video real short. Your 2011 Chrysler Town & Country Dodge Caravan owners with the 3.6. Now, this was the real early built 3.6. There's a build date that uh, this TSB specifies. You know, it has to fall in those parameters for this uh, repair to even apply. So if your car was built early pre-2011, then chances are this apply to your car. All right. Thanks for watching. Comment and subscribe, man. I got a lot of uh, minivan updates and uh, a lot of information I can keep you informed about, you know. But you have to be subscribed and click that notification bell so you know when the video come out. Okay, thanks for watching, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video.